Hey everyone, welcome to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a Snapchat lens tutorial. So to start off you're going to click new project. Now you're going to click the little plus underneath objects on the left hand corner. You're going to go along to face effects and here you're going to click face retouch. Now this will take you onto a menu that looks a bit like this. So you'll have a person and you'll have yourself. So you're going to play around with these little buttons on the side which say soft skin, teeth whitening, eye sharpening and eye whitening. If you want to you can zoom in and this will give you the chance to see it up closely on how your lens will look. Now if you want an image you're going to go to Google and search your image name followed by PNG. This will then allow you to see any of these images and you're going to right click with save as. Now you're going to go back to the plus and you're going to click face image this time. Now you're going to click on texture and insert your image. Now your image will be there so you can move it around a bit, make it as big as you want, put it where you like so as you can see I've put it over the nose and on the cheeks here. Now I want like a kind of tan colour of mine so I'm going to go and click a brown colour and save it as I did into my files. Now I'm going to do the exact same, get it from texture and add it in and then this time it's a little bit different so I'm going to go to blend mode and it will give you loads of different options because at the moment you can't really see me and that's not very good. So as I was saying you go to blend mode and you have all these different options now I'm going to click multiply. So now you can kind of see me and you can play around with the different levels that you can see of the clearness and there you go. So that's my lens complete so now I'm going to go to project info. Now this will give me a chance to name my lens so I've named it holiday blush. At the bottom you can see there's a thing that says hint. Now you can click on the little arrow next to it and it'll give you all these different options on what will come up when you do it when you when someone plays your lens. So I've clicked none for this one and I've also added an icon in the little circle. Now I'm going to go to publish lens. Now this is the final step that you need to. So you can add as up to eight different tags. Now this will get your lens seen by everyone on Snapchat and try and get you more views, shares. So now you want to click scan triggers. Now I've clicked person because of course I want people to be seeing it. Thank you for watching. Bye!